I just love to run. In most communities, you'll see a Thanksgiving tradition to run off the calories before consuming them. We always show up on uh, Thursday morning just to, just to get the energy up for the day, and it's just a lot of fun. This year, Farrington beginning a new tradition to highlight what we all should be thankful for this holiday season. Time spent with friends, family, and loved ones. Something like this, you definitely realize like how much you all need each other. All of this to honor 21-year-old Drew Sepatelli, who was killed last Thanksgiving in an early morning car crash. I want to thank you guys for continuing to show up for us. Months in the making, Drew's best friends wanted this day to be about more than just her death. But a day where everyone who knew and loved Drew could come together and honor her life. So I wanted to make an opportunity for everybody to see each other where we didn't have to be all sad and, you know, something where we could all get together again and we didn't have to be mourning anything. We'd just be, you know, happy to be together. He was expecting around 100 people to show up for Drew. But she had a much larger effect on this community, bringing out over 800 runners, walkers, and volunteers, all dressed in pink, her favorite color. She's the only person that could get all of us to come out here at 20 degrees. Because I don't, personally, I said I'd never do one of these, now I'll do it every year from now on. I think it's amazing, amazing. that this many people showed up to support her. It speaks to who she was as a person and who they are as a family. A new yearly tradition to honor a life taken too soon, but serving as a comfort to her family that she will never be forgotten. Thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Thank you so much. In Barrington, Kelly O'Brien, WMUR News 9.